Welcome to Shep Rambles, where I am Shep, and I tend to ramble about what? Anything and everything. And today we're going to be rambling about Shep Rambles. About this very show. Why? Because this is the 50th episode. You may be thinking, well, why in the world did you wait until now to talk about what this show's about? Well, because it's the 50th episode. I wasn't sure if I would uh, make it all the way to this 50th episode. And uh, since I've made it to 50 episodes, I wanted to commemorate this episode um, with this. I got a, uh, a lavalier microphone that will plug into my uh, cell phone, my Note 8, because it has a headphone jack. <laughs> and it will allow me to be able to record videos that will sound better. Uh, plus, if I'm reading articles, I won't have to sit there and wear those headphones anymore. Although the sound was great, I won't have to wear those headphones anymore. I can just go ahead and just uh, 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 read the article. I won't look like I'm got like flight uh you know headphones on or something like that but uh but also this this will come in handy also for other types of videos such as you know being outside or you know whatever it is that i uh, tend to be doing so uh let's go ahead and open this up and let's take a look and see what we have all right so here it is the boya lavalier microphone the bym1 and uh, superb sound for presentations and video recording. And let's see. So for smartphones, camcorders, DSL, auto recorders, PC, etc. As long as you have a headphone jack. Clip on mic for smartphones, blah, blah, blah. Omnidirectional, high quality condenser is ideal for video use. And there's all the specs. Let's take a look and see what we have here. Be nice to all of my episodes will now start to start sounding better. All right, so I I have like one of these like, like a really old one but uh and like the wires started like getting bent so it wasn't very good. So it looks like off will work for a smartphone and I got chocolate pudding on my hand apparently. Uh and then push up for cameras. And it's got a battery already in here, I believe. And this has a case that it comes with that I just dropped on the floor. <laughs> Let's see here. What do we have in here? Ah! Alright, so we have a adapter and a clip. And a little uh, wind thing here to put on the. And there's the headphone thing. Ah, see, there's the mic. So this is this is a little wind guard there. What else do we have? Um, some salt, gel. Throw away! Don't eat it. Sprinkle it on top of your vegetables and stuff. Something else is in here. What else is in here? Oh. Oh, this is the... <laughs> it's a piece of hair. <laughs> it 
this is the wind guard thing. That's what this is. Okay, so this thing goes around the mic, and then this thing is is uh, it's like a wind. You put this over it, and it helps reduce the wind noise. Um, piece of cardboard. And I believe... Oh, hold on. i got one more thing here. Instructions. Here we go. Blah! Alright, so thanks for choosing Boya. Package contains lapel microphone. Foam windscreen. That's what that is. Clothing clip battery. One-fourth plug adapter and a user guide. If it didn't include a user, guys, like, what are we looking at? I don't know. Uh, okay, so there's the power pack, camera setting, off, smartphone, blah, blah, three millimeter. Yeah, yeah. And using the microphone, insert clip uh, into plastic loop. Um, yeah, that's pretty self-explanatory. Mounting, using it with your camera. And using the microphone with a smartphone. All right, let's see what it says here. Make sure microphone's power pack is set to off smartphone setting before plugging into your smartphone. Does that mean we don't need a battery? Oh, maybe maybe we don't need a battery. Attach the microphone to your clothing, blah, blah, blah. What if I don't want to? Using the microphone with other devices. Audio input jack of your device. Attach the microphone. Uh, placing the battery and screw the two parts. Now, it's possible the battery may not be in. You, you know, we may have to pull it out, and then it may not be put in like correctly, so that way it doesn't drain it. If that makes any sense? Okay. So. All right. Let's hook this baby up. Let's see how it sounds. Alrighty. Well, it sounds really good. So let's talk about Shep Rambles. Um, this show, when I say it's about anything and everything, that's really about what it is. I'm going to take these things off because the light is like just reflecting off of that. That way you can uh, see my eyes would be a little bit better, right? Um, what exactly do I do on the show? Well, I mean, let's, let's take a look at, back at some of the things that I've done in these past, uh, 50 episodes. The very first episode I did in my car inside of a, uh, parking garage. And I just talked about episode, uh, nine for Star Wars thinking that it was going to be a, a two-part episode because I couldn't see how they could uh, resolve it in uh, one movie. And I talked about that way before there were rumors about it being a two-part uh, two part movie before others started talking about it. I'm sure I wasn't the only one, but I talked, I talked about it before it became a thing. But I don't really care who gets credit for it. I just I just talked about it before more. It doesn't really matter. Um, other things that that I've done uh, besides that, I've I've talked about uh, certain news articles uh, that I find interesting that I come across. Sometimes they might be um, a main story that I might want to talk about. And sometimes it might just be some some story that's just uh, off the beaten track that I just thought was kind of odd. Um, that I figured, oh, this would be interesting to talk about, or interesting to read, or interesting to share. Um, sometimes uh, there might actually be uh, something that I think is important, something important to me that. You know, maybe something I didn't know or something that I thought was important to share with others. Um, so I'll share that. And sometimes, you know, it might be uh, sci-fi related. Um, 
that I, I might I might share. Uh, Shed rambles uh, can also include reaction videos. Where I've included reaction videos to trailers and to teasers. I've also talked about uh, certain uh, video games that I happen to like, such as Star Trek Online, or No Man's Sky, or The Sims. Um, it may have to do with other projects that I happen to be working on. One project that I'm working on right now that I'm actually wrapping up uh, back here is a series called Killer Virtual Tours. And this is a combination of several things that I've been doing uh, so far, um, combining my gaming. Uh, this is going to combine elements of flight simulator so things that i've been doing uh with my gaming along with uh some of the uh filming uh things that i learned when i was in film school long 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 ago that i put to use on a couple of videos that i've done uh, one about, uh, just before this one, as a matter of fact, about Jerome and also about the Asylum Restaurant, where I took a whole different approach with it and tried to make it more like a documentary. So, it's kind of like I'm coming full circle on a lot of this stuff. So, with the Killer Virtual Tours, I am combining elements of the of those documentary features along with the gaming um, and it will also include uh, some machinima along along the ways uh, some animation um, so uh, and also Shep Rambles will will include um, you know a few personal things also nothing too personal you know, I'm not going to sit there and start, you know, spilling my guts, you know, about uh, things that are really nobody's business. Um, but it'll, it's more to share things uh, for family, uh, friends. Um, my, my daughter and her children down the line. Uh, that way they can kind of get an idea of who I am. Um, as a person, because um, I'm getting older with age, and you know, I don't know how much longer I'm going to be around, but I like to leave something uh, on this world for them, a, a piece of myself, and my thoughts and things that make me me. <laughs> <clears throat> So I'll be talking about things, um, uh, just uh, things that come to mind, really. Um, I might talk about uh, religion or um, exercise or maybe just review movies or books or uh, just thoughts that come to my head. Uh, uh, techniques and, and uh, money. Uh, something else that I've talked about uh, on Shep Rambles is in regards to the stock market. I've, I've done stuff with that. Um, I did go into a slightly uh, personal thing in regards to RVs, uh, like my personal taste between uh, motorhomes versus fifth, fifth wheels and which one I like better. So um, one thing I'm going to do my best to uh, not talk about on Shep Rambles is politics. Politics is such a nasty, nasty, nasty thing uh, to talk about these days, uh, whether it's right wing, left wing, liberal, conservative, whatever. Um, <sighs> It doesn't seem like you can win, no matter which way, uh, no matter what, no matter no matter what you follow. So, 
I think I think both sides have good arguments. I think both sides have things they need to learn from each other. I don't think one side is more right than the other. Um, and quite frankly, with the way politics have been going lately, uh, whether you're right or left, it, it's all gotten to the point where it's just giving me a headache. And it's, it's just too much for me now. So um, I, I, I really just don't want to get into it uh, when it comes to Shep Rambles. So I'm going to do my very best to just kind of stay away from politics as much as possible. Um, uh, other than that, um, something else that I want to do with Shep Rambles is, uh, is, is kind of, uh, keep going with what I did with Jerome and what I did with the Asylum Restaurant and do more documentary type of stuff. Uh, doing short little road trips and doing, uh, some, uh, documentaries of, of, of these trips and some of these places that I go into. So it's, um, it's this, this show is meant to be an open format. I don't want it to limit me to one thing or another. It's meant to stay open and flexible. So that way I can I can use it. It's it's also like a vlog, as well. Um, and I don't know. It's uh, it's 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 uh, something that I that I feel that I'm going to be doing for uh, quite a while, just because it is very flexible and. It allow me to do pretty much whatever I what whatever I want with it. So, um, you know, I'm I you know, excited that we um, got to fifty episodes, and I'm looking forward to another fifty episodes and uh, many more years um, after that. And. Uh, you know, for all of you who have been uh, sticking with me through all these videos, uh, I know at the moment I don't have a whole lot of subscribers um, or a whole lot of views. But for those of you who are watching, um, I appreciate you. I, I really do. Um, I, you know, I hope you stick around and, and, and I hope you um, continue watching. Uh, what I put out, I, you know, I, I, I don't want to, I don't want to be like some of these other channels where they're doing like this uh, song and dance and, uh, and trying to overreact and, uh, you know what I mean? Uh, the whole overacting and stuff like that, like trying to get attention type of thing. I'm just, I'm a very down to earth, basic type of guy. I'm just, I'm just straightforward. I'm just going to kind of talk to you as if, as if you're right there. So it's just, just, just kind of how I am. You know, I'm not going to, you know, try to pretend to be something that I'm not. So, um, I just, I feel that that kind of uh, communication is just more honest. Um, and, you know, I hope you can be honest with me, whether it's a uh, positive or, 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 you know, negative criticism, you know, it's all good. You know, you can let me know in the, in the comment section. That's why it's there. You know, let me know what it is that you like or what it is that you think I, I should improve. You know, without you and without your support, I'm not going to be able to build this channel and, and make it better. So, you know, please, you know, let me know what it is, the, the things that you like and maybe the things that maybe I shouldn't, I should leave out. Um, don't say leave out Shep Rambles. 
this is one show that I want to keep going because it's 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 my vlog. It's 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 uh, it it's it's my I don't want to call it my soapbox, but it's it's my it's my medium. It's 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 my way to uh, express myself and just kind of experiment and just kind of do different things with. So, um, but there are other things that I do on this channel too. I do a variety. Of, I, I try to do a variety of different things on this channel. But that's not what we're talking about. We're just talking about this show. But that's pretty much it um, in regards that I really want to talk about right now in regards to Chef Rambles. So um, anyways, um, again, uh, thanks uh, for your support and for hanging with me. And hey, I hope you're still around for another 50 episodes and many more after that. We'll see you on another rambling video. Again, I want to thank all of you who have been hanging with me through all of these episodes. And if you're new, welcome. Thanks for tuning in, and I hope you'll consider sticking around for many more episodes. On the screen is a small sample of some of the topics I've covered on this show, but I've also got a playlist you can check out that has all of them. And if you subscribe, you'll get notified of anything new uploaded to the channel. And it just shows your support of the channel and lets me know how cool you are. Thanks for watching and we'll ramble again soon.